Hi, my name is Haley. I'm here at the Arbor Foot Health Center with Dr. Gary Prant. We're here today to discuss some common shoe questions that most people have. What kind of shoe should I wear? Uh, so I thought we would do a little segment today on just general shoe wear. Most people when they're exercising or running need good support. What specifically should we look for in a shoe? Well, this is my shoe actually, for example. One thing we should look for is what's called an Achilles notch, is something that's in the back would, that would have a little depression here. And so that actually relieves pressure at the Achilles tendon. Not the heel counter stiffens uh, the back of the shoe for stability. Another thing that we're seeing in the shoe market currently is what's called a varus heel. Now, if you, I'm not sure if you can tell, but there's a slight in, uh, curvature to the heel of my shoe that is tilted towards the big toe side. And you'll notice that more in some shoes rather than others. Now, what that's doing is, say you're running, that's putting a lot of pressure on the outside of the leg, maybe causing it for you to roll in. So you might get shin splints or you might get peroneal tendonitis. These are problems that you might want to discuss with your podiatrist if you're having such issues. Sure. So another little thing that I thought we would mention and that we like to see in shoes are, is a removable insert in sole. Um, so it basically looks like this. Mine's a little dirty. Um, but the reason we like a removable insole is so that you can add a custom orthotic or a over-the-counter orthotic that you can add. Well, mine's pretty much glued in, but this is essentially what it looks like. And it kind of gives a little bit of a correction, especially if you have problems such as plantar fasciitis.